It was the perfect storm, a winter of pounding rain and mountain snow. Moving Earth and uncovering new riches long buried. Today in California, it's a new gold rush. This year's a great year because the water has just moved so much new material. Easy gold, I call it. Yeah. Easy gold year. We met this collection of hardcore hobbyists at the heart of the original gold rush, Placerville Hardware, in business since 1852. So you've got every different kind of pan you could think of. The guys geared up. Let's go find some gold. To hit a few hidden hotspots where raging runoff might unearth pay dirt. But as we quickly learned, there's no easy money. How long will you spend in there? All day if you can. <laughs> <laughs> it can be hours of backbreaking manual labor, deadlifting boulders in ice cold streams, just for a shot at that golden ticket. <laughs> but these guys are pros. This is gold that came right out of that spot, Albert's down there working. All this is gold just yeah, now. That's all that's gold. After a little more digging and a few more finds, it was time to move on. How much do you think we got? I don't know, probably enough for dinner maybe, <laughs> gas. I tried my hand on dry land. <laughs> huh? This is a spot. We're digging here. Turns out I miscalculated, but the pros struck again. Oh, oh there, there, there it is. There. Yeah. Experts say you'd be hard pressed trying to get rich from striking gold. Uh, what's the one piece of advice that you tell people when searching for gold? Don't give up until you find a piece of gold. And even if you don't strike it rich, sometimes the real treasure is in the hunt. You got the gold fever. Yeehaw! Steve Patterson, NBC News, Gold Country, California. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.